Hello and welcome to the Weebly Does What web series. Today I'm going to show you how to add pages to your web page and when you're adding pages it actually creates your navigation bar. Let's begin. Click on pages. You see that we have three pages that Weebly automatically creates for you. I will show you how to add more and how to delete these. First, to add, we're going to go to the plus sign. It's going to ask you which type of page you want to add. A standard web page, a blog page, a store page, or an external page. What an external page is, is when you click on your menu on that page, it's going to actually go to an external web page. For example, if you have a YouTube channel, and you want to put a link right here to YouTube, you just click it and it will automatically go to the YouTube page. That's an external page. I'm going to go ahead and click standard page. Whatever you name the page will end up on your navigation menu. So you see right now it says new page. I'm going to change that to resources. You can hide the page in your navigation. You would do this if you have a page that you may use at certain times. For example, maybe a fundraiser that you don't want to delete the whole page, but you may want to hide it in your navigation menu. It's going to ask you what type of header you want. This is your header. We'll talk about that in a different video. You can choose tall, short, or no header, a landing page, splash, or title. I'm going to go ahead and leave it on short header. The visibility, leave on public, unless you have a paid Weebly account, then you can use the other two options. And advanced, I never really play with. You can if you want to, but I just leave blank. I'm going to save it. You see that my page is right here on my navigation menu, resources. Now I can move this page where I would like to. I can click and drag it wherever I would like to drag it. I'm going to put it right after the home page. Now it moved. If I wanted it under a page, for example, I may move it down. And then if I move it slightly to the right, it's going to go under the about page. Notice my navigation menu. Now when I hover over about, I have a resources page under about. I want to take it back out, slide it to the left, and now it's here. This is how you add and manipulate your pages. If you want to delete a page or edit it, simply click on it. I can edit the name at any time. I can change the header. I can also delete the page. You see that it erased from my navigation menu. I can also copy the page. When would you want to copy a page? Maybe if you're doing a page per class period, first period, second period, third period, you may not want to add or create a brand new page for each class period, but you may want to copy it and then simply change first period to second period. So you can copy a page. You see, I have two resources pages now. I can click on either one and change it. To whatever I want to change it to. I'm going to change it to resources too. So this is how you add, delete, and edit your pages and navigation bar on Weebly. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and have a great day.